Okay, hi guys. So I am in my bedroom and I'm gonna give you guys a quick peek at my wall art. Someone asked me if I would share about the, some of the art on my wall. Sometimes when I'm making videos, I am in my bedroom and you can kind of see this earring display in the background along with a couple other photos. So let me show you what I have here. So this is just my earring display. I have all of my pretty much just my casual everyday earrings hair flowers hair clips have all that on this wall and this is just a shelf liner and i have it just hanging up with some tags in each corner i did a video of this last year i think okay so let me take you to the wall art Back in 2005, when I first got my dreadlocks, I was just obsessed. So I found these photos in a book, just like a regular hair book, and I had them matted and framed. So every one of these pictures, the person has dreadlocks. And I just, my, my lock journey is over, but I haven't switched out these photos. I still enjoy looking at them. Then above my bed, I just have this photo of this lady with an afro, like a white afro. And I am going to create a, a bigger um, display. That photo is just so small. I just printed it on my computer and framed it, but I'm going to do like three more to make that a little bigger. For the size of that wall, I just have that one little small picture there. So I'm not done with that. So let me show you this other wall. I'm going to try not to let y'all see my full bedroom because it is a mess. Okay, so this is my other wall. And that backlight is going to be a glare. But just different photos of people with dreadlocks. And I just have them hanging there. And I am still inspired by them. I love them. So, they'll stay for now until I come up with something else. Now, this right here is just a piece of fabric that I have tacked on the wall. Just an open space. And I just, I don't know, I probably should... Um, do something with it but it's just there for now I still like it I purchased it with every intention of having a sundress made out of it or a halter top or something but when I got it in the mail I purchased it off eBay it wasn't large enough and then when I contacted the seller he was sold out so sometimes I'll put a chair in front of it and just use it as a backdrop for when I make videos So that's it. That's the um, the wall art in my bedroom. And again, my earring display. And let me show you the wall art in the um, hallway because it kind of, let's see, I, these dreadlock photos, there's five of them, but it's a total of seven. I kind of ran out of room, so I put these two in the hallway. And these are more tribal inspired. But it all kind of went with the whole dreadlock theme. Love, love, love this one. And those are just in my hallway. Okay, guys, there you have it. Let me know if you have any questions. I will see you guys in my next video.